One of the greatest parts of my job as a lawyer at this firm is getting the opportunity to help families who have children that were injured by uh, actions at a daycare or a preschool. One of the hardest things as a parent who works is to entrust your children to other people, to take them in the morning and drop them off at a place where all you can really do is try and make a good decision about whose hands you place them in and then drive away and, and genuinely hope for the best and believe that the universe will make sure that your, your child is safe. So many times uh, what we hope happens for our children while they are in the care of others doesn't come true. And oftentimes children are so young that they have a difficult time expressing exactly what may have happened to them while they were in someone else's care. We've developed a, a neat specialty in being able to not just identify abusers, not just identify the rules and regulations and standards that are violated which lead to the abuse, but also to identify the damage that's done to a child at a young age, not just physically, but oftentimes emotionally. And so when parents come to us and, and they tell us that they have a strong belief that their child was abused or neglected at a daycare or at a preschool, we oftentimes make it our mission not just to validate and verify what the parent has said, but to get to the bottom of how and why it happened, the damage that it caused, and how can it be prevented in the future for other children. And so while many lawyers do many great things, I am so honored to be a part of a team that oftentimes represents children in cases where they have been neglected at a preschool or a daycare.